Well, with Memorial Day fast approaching now and summer-like temperatures finally arriving this week, a lot of people, of course, thinking about hitting the beach. Oh, yes. And as Channel 3 New Haven Bureau Chief Matt McFarland shows us, some swimming spots along the shoreline are better than others. The unofficial start to summer, less than a week out, and for some, it's already here. Hammonasset Beach State Park, always a popular spot. You've got the beach, the camping, and some might say the water quality as well, because according to Save the Sound, this spot getting an A-plus rating. We love it here. We're here all the time, all year round. And for Stephanie and her little guys, Cullen and Jamison, they were having a pretty good time splashing around in the sound. The water's cold. It's the same, whether you're just ankle deep or going in for a quick dip, like Brooke and Gabby, high schoolers who decided to turn a half day into a beach day. Freezing. It's freezing. It makes me want to go back up to my towel, <laughs> but I think I needed that polar plunge. <laughs> same, yeah. It's really cold, but very refreshing. But that water is also pretty clean. Ham and Asset scoring some pretty high marks on Save the Sounds report card that comes out every two years. The Environmental Action Group gives nearly 200 shoreline beaches letter grades based on water quality data from local health departments. We come down here pretty often, you know, we're from Connecticut, so it's either here or Lyme. According to Save the Sound's 2023 beach report, 78% of the beaches either earned an A or a B. Rocky Neck State Park scored a D plus, with Byram Park Beach in Greenwich getting an F. Save the Sound says water quality is hyper local, with rainfall often being the primary driver for water pollution at many Long Island Sound beaches. Increasing rainfall brought on by climate change threatens to undo decades of progress unless we act now. We're calling on elected officials to prioritize investment in repairs and improvements to sewer lines and stormwater systems. And while plenty were taking advantage of the warm temps to get in a quick swim, Stephanie says she agrees with the A-plus beach ranking here at Hammonasset. But swimming this early, we'll just have to wait. It is. Yeah. I'll go in. Not today, but I will. <laughs> Want to see how your favorite beach scored? We've got a link on the WFSB app. Reporting at Hammond Asset Beach State Park. Matt McFarland, Channel 3, Eyewitness News. All right, Matt.